Good evening viewers, I'm 21st Century Cat, and this is Colin the Cat. And he's here for no reason whatsoever, apart from he just decided to sit down while I'm trying to do some filming. Right viewers, now what I'd like to talk about tonight is old videos. Videos that you post on a channel that, once they're off that front page, just don't seem to get seen by anybody. So it occurred to me that I have old videos that it's very likely people will never watch. And I just thought as a one-off exercise, I would repost something from my back catalogue. So I'm going to embed it in this video. So what will I choose? Will I go for my Christmas specials, back when I had less than 100 subscribers? Dr. Love, The Love Doctor, when I had about 150 subscribers. Maybe my Vegas series. No, I think you've seen enough of my Vegas holiday. Viewers, I'm going to post or repost a video that I originally uh, posted in pretty much exactly a, a year ago. What will it be? Let's find out. What are you waving your tail for? Wait. Wait. Oh, is it going? Yeah. How can you tell? Red light there, I think. Oh yeah, it says wreck. Right, good evening viewers. Uh, thanks for joining us again. Uh, good evening. Good evening, right. Okay, I'm 21st Century Cat, this is... Mr. Funny. Well, no, Andy. Is Andy. Actually in Andy, aka Mr. Funny. But we don't need to go through that yet again, do we? Right. Okay, well, what have we talked about so far? We first film was all about the, uh, what, Mr. Funny? Yeah. The second film was about salsa dancing, although we're not sure we're going to post that. Didn't go too well, did it? No. No, no. Are you call yourself funny? It kind of got loud. <laughs> well, there's no come wrong. It was it got it's all with a bit like that. It's, it, it got led up the wrong way. You were leading me up the wrong path. <laughs> Shall we say, we'll leave it there. So what, what should we talk about tonight? Well, I'll tell you what we'll talk about tonight. Me and Andy, <laughs> we're, we're good mates. Uh, we went on holiday a couple of months ago. We went to um, Greece, Rhodes. Went Lindos. to Rhodes. What? Lindos in Rhodes, yeah? And I was saying to Andy while we were on holiday, great place, uh, I'd love to go back there again. And I just said, you know, in a heterosexual way, you know, where would you want to go in future? And I think I said, Andy, how about... Canada. So I've been to Canada, I thought, good mate, maybe go touring around Canada, around the outback. I don't know if there is an outback in Canada. Well, it's not important. And what did you tell me, Andy? Why would... What were your issues with Canada? I said I didn't want to go to Canada because it was full of bears. <laughs> <laughs> so what were you saying that, you know... Bears. The bears. Yeah, I know. I, you didn't mean like the baseball or the... Grizzly bears. Grizzly bears. Yeah. So, you, you were thinking if you were going around Toronto, that you'd be walking down the high street... And you'd be chased by a bear. Yeah. yeah. I've seen them on the telly. They break into cars. <laughs> and I've heard that they can run at 32 miles an hour. And I can't run that fast. Now, viewers, I know this sounds pretty staged, but this is unfortunately a very true conversation. Uh, literally, I think me and Andy were sitting and on the beach. I can't climb a tree to get away from them either. You can't climb a tree to get away from a bear. No. What about if you're just in a shop in the middle of a big city? Well, I don't know. <laughs> but, <laughs> suffice to say, you're not willing to take the risk, yeah? Oh, no, no. I certainly don't want to be in a fight with a bear. <laughs> have you ever seen the damage a bear can do? Yeah, I have, yeah. <laughs> that was an advert on what? telly that you saw, though. That was that was a real where you saw the, the salmon... I'm like, not talking about that advert. No, I've seen other stuff on Channel 5. <laughs> like what? the damage that they can... Like inflict. what? <clears throat> <clears throat> well, they can just... You know, have you seen the size of a bear? <laughs> do you want to have a fight with a bear? <laughs> no, I don't. No, know. nor do I. Yeah, they would steer, steer clear of Canada. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> So you've just seen Mr. Funny on Canada. 
why did I choose that video to repost? You know, now I've got at least a few more viewers. Why did I choose that video to get my more recent viewers to watch? Well, basically, that was probably the first video that I did, or it was one of the first videos I did with Mr. Funny. And let me give you a very sort of brief story. I've, I've read before now that on The Simpsons, they aim for a joke every six seconds. Um, now, the idea is, I mean, if you watch The Simpsons, they're not all verbal jokes, jokes told. A lot of it is uh, funny things happening in the background. That was the first video where I went to edit it, and I had no idea I was going to add all the extra pictures and the running polar bear and all the other stuff. Um, but I watched it and I thought, this is, this is right, this is quite funny, but how can I make it funnier? And I thought, I know what, put something in the background, put something funny in the background so that even if what you're saying isn't that interesting, um, the viewers will still be entertained. I mean, you can accuse me of using gimmicks, which I don't normally try to do. I like to have my videos straight between me and you, the viewer, mono a mono, tete a tete. Hey, Colin, what do you think? Is that true? Yeah. So, viewers, oh, was there another reason I chose that or not? I made some notes. No, no, the Simpsons analogy, that's pretty much it, adding all the extra jokes. Okay, that's why I chose it. Phrases. The shopkeeper is standing behind the counter. More of a statement, really, than a phrase. Basically, viewers, my parents came down last weekend, and for some reason they brought with them one of my old school books. Hmm. Live long and prosper. I can't do that. Live long and prosper, and that's... Is that right? That's what I call a phrase. Anyway, viewers, as always, I digress. So, where was I? Colin. Mm -hmm. 